we're going to do an example program here just to see the use of Cartesians in programming a move. I'm at my home position here with my focus on infinity and I'm going to enable my robot. My focus is already enabled. I'm going to go into roll level to make sure my roll is controlled and I'm going to initially go into locked world. Do the go to which will just level up the roll. My first action here is to use my Y to move across the scene I'm going to use X to move back to more Y. Until my target comes close to being in scene, I'm now going to lift. I'm using Cartesian locked world to do all of these actions. I'm now in a position I'm slightly too close to my target so I'm going to come out a little bit to there. So I'm going to store that as my pos A position. I'm also going to now measure exactly where I am. This is my measure hook. In this case, the measure hook is on the film plane and I would put my tape measure on the measure hook to take measurements. Target distance is 76. Now if I type in my target distance here and go to position 1. My focus pulls. Saw that there. Now I'm going to go into Cartesian view and I'm going to use Cartesian view to rotate around my target to there. I have a slight variation in position there. However, I'm going to use that as my start position, but I'm going to use Cartesian view to set that position and just to line up perfectly I'm going to use locked view to trim my side to side shot of my target that is now my first position now back into Cartesian view I'm going to pull out on X. That is going to be my end position. Add a line and using Cartesian view I have pulled out in X and my focus axis has pulled out the correct distance and my target has correspondingly been pulled out the correct distance. So I now have a two position move and I have a 25 frames camera running and four second move there. So if I now Robot fast, back run, and shoot it. 
That is my move. If I wish to now, I can see if I can make that go faster. Let's see if I can run that faster. There I have. It took me just over five minutes and I have programmed a useful move. This has been a Mark Roberts motion control training video. Thank you for watching.